everybody, welcome back to Balloons TD5, and today we are playing some co-op mode, that's right. Now, uh, this is just another, another regular episode. Now, I am going to use something other than the Dart Monkey, uh, Special Tower. Just, I'm just gonna mix it up, I don't know. Maybe I'm gonna do something fancy, do something special. I think I'm gonna start with a, um, I don't know, maybe we could do something different. I'm feeling something different today. Increase attack speed. Um, oopsies. I think I might actually use the boomerangs. So I'm gonna use the boomerangs today. Now I have everything else activated. Let's just go on for a random co-op, random co-op game. And we want any map, and um, improbable or hard. So it's been. A while since I've done some of the- oh, cool! 2400. Yeah, so I don't think I've ever played this map. This is on Impopable, and this is two times money. So I get two times as much cash for, for playing these games. That's pretty awesome. Did you just start it? Oh my god, what are you doing, bud? What are you doing? Why did I use the Dart Monkey? Dart Monkey Special Tower really isn't that great. What? I just put you there. What is happening? I put him there. Oh, that was his. I don't know. I don't know what happened there. They wouldn't let me place my dart monkey. Right, well, we're good now. That was embarrassing. We lost on like round one. Anyways, alright, let's just pretend that didn't happen. So I don't know, for this map, this is actually a pretty difficult map on Impoppable. Uh, so hopefully, hopefully we should do all right though. I should have used my Dart Monkeys for this for sure. And I didn't, so that was my mistake. I don't know, I, I was just feeling like mixing it up. I thought it was gonna be a more, a, a bit of an easier map. Cause the last episodes we, we played, the maps really weren't difficult at all. Or they were on hard mode. Um, and this is like, this is like way up there. This is an impop, or this is one of the hardest maps on impoppable. So, yeah, we should do all right though. I'm gonna put up a, uh, I'm gonna put up a dart monkey anyways, just to take care of some of the. Uh, I don't know. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get triple spikes on them. Why did I upgrade that? I don't know. Yeah, but the triple shot is really good. Triple shot is one of the best tower, or in my opinion, I think I think it's one of the best like beginning towers. Just dart monkeys in general are actually really good. A lot of people underestimate them, but if you use a lot of dart monkeys, then then you can get a really good defense up early. Anyways, after a while they start to lose their luster, but for the beginning rounds, they're pretty good. I gotta say, I think he's saving it for a banana farm, which is which is good. Yeah, yeah, he, sh he should be staying up for Banana Farm right now. And, uh, I should be too. Oh no, what did he do? Why did he do that? We need farms. Oh man, he put a balloon chipper up for some reason. Let's hope this guy knows what he's doing. I'm trusting him. Alright, there we go. That means that he's gonna be putting up farms. I don't know why I put that up, but because <laughs> that's sort of blocking his farms. I don't know, maybe he's not gonna put that many. We'll see. I'm gonna set up for my farms now, and uh, hopefully try to get those guys up as soon as I can. Now, let me know. Do you guys like like Do you guys like this kind of video? Do you guys like co-op mode? I know it's a mixed it's a mixed bag. Some of you guys say, "Well, I'd sort of rather the the other co-op mode that you were doing." And then some people say this is like the greatest thing ever, and they'd so much rather this. So let me know in the comments if you guys would rather this or like the Steam edition of co-op mode with when I talk to people. Because I'm not really sure. For now, I think I'm just gonna do a bit of both. But I can. Which one do you guys rather? So yeah, go ahead and let me know because I I don't know. I like I enjoy making both. 
believe we're going to have some LEDs coming up here soon. If not already, I might have... Yeah, some may have already come out. I'm not sure. I'm actually going to put up... I think I'm actually going to put up... Agents. Just because I have them. Just because I can. There we go. That'll do. And, um... What do I want to do? I want... Oh, no. I, I need to get my, my farmer. Yeah, here we go. Alright, I'm going to set my farm up. Hmm. I don't know where to put it, though. Actually, right here should do. Yeah, alright. We're good. We're good. Alright, now we're just gonna be sitting. Alright, he already has his two farms. Uh, we should be alright, I think. Maybe? I don't know, I have those agents up top. I'm gonna buy some more of these bushes. And I'm gonna, I don't know what. For whatever it's worth, I'm gonna put. Some of my. No, it's not even worth it. That's the problem, because unless he has them on his side, then it, it doesn't really do much. Yeah, whatever. I don't know. I'm feeling like just agenting, like just spamming agents, because I can. Oh, this is what I gotta get up. Alright, so let me get this guy up before I get another farm. Actually, no. No, farms would be smarter. Yeah, alright. So I'm gonna go try and. I'm gonna try and stay a little bit more late game. Or focus on the late game right now. And. It'd be good to get a farm up right now. But next thing that I'm gonna do is I'm gonna upgrade this guy. Because I, I forgot all about that. <laughs> That's a special tower. And we haven't upgraded him. And we're gonna go for a uh, bottom right. Or, yeah, the Bionic Boomer is way better, in my opinion, in this game. Uh, in Bloons CD5. In uh, Bloons Monkey City, I do enjoy using the Glaive Ricochet, but especially with this. With this. Um, the special tower, I think, I think the. Uh, Boomerang throws or the, the Bionic Boomer is just like really really overpowered in a good way though Otherwise the special tower wouldn't be worth it at all I mean the best special tower is probably just the dart monkey because for the for the beginning of the games I think anyways different people have different opinions on that, but I'd say that's the best Which specialty tower do you guys use? Let me know. Uh, Cause I don't know. I've heard I've heard some people say like I know a lot of people do like the boomer. The uh, dart if you use dartling guns, dartling guns are actually really really good. Uh, the dartling gun special tower because it has one plus one pierce and you can set them to different targets so you can set up like cool little defenses in fact I think I might do that like ep next episode or whatever I might try and set up a cool little defense with my uh, dartling guns or somewhere also I'm gonna do a mastery series uh, a mastery mode series I don't know when that's gonna be coming out because I have to actually unlock mastery I'm pretty close now but I don't know I've just I just haven't been playing much of this game unless I'm recording so I don't know. Ooh, can I fit another one in? Yeah, I can, I can squeeze another one in right there. Oh, wow, that's actually quite a bit. There's quite a few balloons coming in right now. I might just have my agents open just in case I need to axe it or in case I need to, like, monkey storm something. Super monkey storm. Yeah, we should be good for now. Oh, man, those bananas are really not that great if you have Rego balloons. That's awful. I'm gonna get up a, uh... I don't know. Yeah, I guess I just have to upgrade my farm still. There's not much to do. These are the rounds, these are the important rounds right here. This is where I have to get as many farms up as I can in order to afford for the later rounds because it's gonna get pretty tricky.
Alright, hopefully he'll get the Moab sucker, whatever you call it, on his uh, balloon chipper before the mob comes out. We still have some time, you know, we still have like six rounds. Or five. So we should be good. But I'm not really feeling like restarting right now. Yeah, if we if we lose, I think I'm just gonna call it an episode. Yeah, but hopefully that won't happen, so you guys don't have to worry. Alright. No! No! I can't this can't be an episode. He quit? I spoke too soon. Come on. I can't believe we lost that. We weren't even doing that bad. I just got a little bit too greedy with the money. Ah, <sighs> how about this? I'm gonna do an easy or medium. I'm gonna do an easy or medium round. All right, I'm sorry, I don't know. I got a little bit too greedy there with my, with my farms. I should have just just called it quits there and just gone on for uh, defense, but I didn't. That was my bad. I should have tossed up some helicopters or something. But I'm gonna do that uh, dartling gun thing right now, just to, just for fun. And we're just gonna go on. We're going easier medium. Uh, actually, let's just go on medium. Just because I don't want it to be too long. If we if we did a whole new impossible or hard match. Then it would be way too difficult, or I mean, not too difficult. What am I saying? It would be it would be way too long this episode, so I don't want it to run on too long. So uh, we're not gonna do a full, we're gonna do a full episode, or a full a full hard game. Um, we can't afford darling guns right off, right off the, uh, right off the bat. So what we're gonna do, we're actually gonna agent it up. Alright, we're gonna put an agent there, and an agent there. <laughs> and then we're also gonna put, let's see, a Rattadak, I want one of those guys. Where are they? There we are. I want one of those guys right there. Alright, <laughs> we're good. And we have tons of lives too, we have plenty of lives. I should actually put, I should start with like a ninja monkey. Oh no! He, oh, this is the bad side. Crap! Man, this is awful for Ratodactyls. Damn! Ah, oh, I was think I wanted the other side. You see, because if I have the other side, then the the um, Ratodactyls will go into the balloons. So they'll. Uh, so now they're not gonna get nearly as many pops. That sucks. Oh, that's awful. Well, they are bigger, so hopefully it will still help a little bit when all five of them come out. Because I have the pro, you know, because they're pro, their wings are a lot bigger. So, now that now that all of them are out, hopefully we should be good. But, that's still, that's still really unfortunate. What can you do, though? I didn't notice that. I'm actually going to put these up over here. Wow, I can put them way over there, huh? Yeah, I put them right there. Let me grab my monkey farmer because that's a really annoying spot. Oof, that's such an annoying spot to collect. <coughs> I'm just gonna collect them now until I get another farm up. I'm just gonna get like a level zero farm or whatever. Yeah, dude, we can keep going. Alright, hopefully we'll be able we're gonna be able to get it here in a sec. Oh wow, that's actually a pretty good place for the sub, huh? Alright. And there. Alright, here we go. So I don't even know I don't even know why I'm putting all these uh, farms up. Realistically, we could do this without any farms at all. Because it's only on medium. And it's an, and it's a pretty easy map. Now, if this were on Impopple, I know, even on Impopple, this map is pretty easy. I can't believe we, la we lost that last one, though. That's that's really aggravating. We haven't lost one in a while, I don't think, in this, in this series. 
At least not recently. Maybe in my, uh, in my old videos, but... Yeah, I think we've lost one yet. Maybe, I don't know. <laughs> I was just talking, that's funny. I was just talking about what we would do if we lost two. No, but I couldn't call it quits at round 41 or whatever it was. That's a weird, that's just not, I can't do that. Uh, but it's alright, you know, we're just... Uh, this is just a little fun, a fun round. This is a bonus collection, alright? This is, this is the bonus round, guys. I don't know why I got that, got those two bloomberry bushes, but whatever. Oh, you know what? We're gonna need someone to pop the leads. And we're going to put up... Hopefully his glue should be able to get it, right? Sort of hoping that glue could get it. But I'm gonna put a sniper just in Actually, I don't want there. Let me put a sniper there just in case. Alright, we're good now. Why did he sell his glue gunner? I don't know what he's doing. I don't think he even knows what he's doing. <laughs> uh, but whatever. That's fine, I guess. I'm gonna put up one of these. Actually. Ah, oh, I can't fit any more. Uh, will that reach? It should reach. I think you can squeeze one in right there. Oops. There we go. Okay, I can fit one in right there. And it doesn't have the range now, but when I add this, it should. Oh, jeez, it's not reaching right there. Whoops. Yeah, I guess we'll have to do this. Alright, that's fine. And uh, there we go, now that reaches. Now we can start upgrading our uh, banana republics, even though we don't really need them. And, uh, yeah, we, so we got these dartling gun special towers and we haven't used any. Let's toss them up. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna put them down here. And in order to get rain, oh, whoops. All right, so I'm gonna put him right there. I know he's not in range of a village. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna give this village more range by adding the beacon. What? I thought I could have sworn that works. What? I thought that worked. Oh man, it doesn't work. I guess I'll have to upgrade this one. Man, that stinks. Damn. Alright, whatever, that's fine. I'm over it. Let's just get- we're gonna go for laser- We're gonna go for the laser cannon upgrade on our, uh, on our dartling guns. Oh, we want Blintonium. Oh, we gotta fix the target on this one. It's a little bit off, it looks like. Yeah, there we go. So you can get pretty solid defenses with these, uh, with these dartling guns. Uh, just gotta toss that up there. All right, now we're looking pretty solid. We're looking, uh, we're looking at pretty solid defense right here. See, these guys are pretty fun to use. Look, I have a colorful headset now. This is new. I just got this, and it's actually, it's actually backwards. For some reason, they put the colors on the other side. Like they put the colors on the back. I don't know why they did that. Cause like I got it. 
because I thought it'd be cool to record with, right? So then you guys could see like my colorful headset. But they're on the back, you can't see it at all. So I'm actually wearing it backwards because because <laughs> I want you guys to be able to see the colors. Like, what's the point of that? I don't know. I mean, I guess I understand. So it's not really meant to like you know for like to look cool in face cams or whatever that's not that's not the point of it i think it's mostly because uh yeah like who's gonna see it you know they, they probably think who's gonna see it if it's uh if you're in the front like like you're f usually just facing your tv your screen so like who's gonna see it then and uh that's probably what they were what they were after but if you record like me and you have a face cam then i want i want you guys to be able to see it so I'm just wearing it backwards. Haha. <laughs> I tricked them. I tricked them good. Alright, we're just tossing up a balloon chipper just to take care of this. Because I know he's not going to be able to take care of it. <laughs> he has two balloon chippers up in a submarine. That's all he has. It's a sad world out there. But it's okay. We're going to grab a, uh, a banana research facility real quick. We're going to grab a factory. Actually, yeah, yeah, we're getting a factory here. Now, I wonder if my village reaches his side. So, I know, I thought it always did. I always thought that it reached their side when you're playing co-op. But I'm not sure if that's true because on the Steam edition that we are playing, apparently it doesn't actually count unless they have the upgrade as well. So if both the people have the upgrade to make the beacons bigger, then it will it will count for the other guy's towers. So it'll make them cheaper and, and give them all the uh, all the upgrades. But but that's only if they have the upgrade too. If they have the premium upgrade as well. If they don't have it, then it's just like a regular beacon range, which sort of sucks. So I'm not really sure if it's like that on the on the iOS version, but but yeah. It's like that on the Steam version, which is weird. I don't like that. I don't know, maybe it could just be like a glitch. I know it's uh, there are quite a few things that are slightly different that are a bit glitchy on the uh, on the Steam version. Like the bananas, you, the bananas on their side, you can like pick up and and even though they don't count for anything, and I don't know, it's not like it on on here. I don't think. Well. It, well, okay, it is like that on here. As you can see, their banana is dropping over there, but um, I can't pick them up. Like I'm tapping right now, and you know, I I can't pick anything up. It shows them picking it up. So I don't know. Just a weird little difference. <coughs> All right, so we have three. We have three of our five banana factories right now. And I think we're actually good. I don't think we need to get the others up. I think I'm just going to go for my other laser cannon. And uh, maybe just a helicopter, actually. Yeah, we're going to go for a, uh, an Apache. Because those guys are good. I don't know. <laughs> Why not? Oh, and we could go for a, a temple. Will we have enough time and money? I don't think so. Eh, yeah, we'll skip the temple. We could go with fancy glue gunner though. Uh, yeah, it should be. Just checking if that was in range. Alright, so I go for. There we go. <laughs> Just cause, I don't know. Why not? Even though he's gonna get like no pops. Alright, so this is what I think. Now, there are people. Uh, I might as well grab these. Um. Wait, no, I didn't want that upgrade. All right, I don't know about this. So, when you have a glue gunner, so you get this one, you get this upgrade, and then you get this upgrade, right? And then you want these two. So that's like the that's like what most people get for the glue gunner, which is good. You know, I I agree that that's good. But then there's this balloon liquefier, and I don't think it's good at all. Like I don't know what the point of it is. So it pops one balloon instantly and liquefies balloons. 10 times every second like yeah that's that's all right but you don't need speed when you have this upgrade because this if you have it placed at the beginning of the track in almost every track it will pop all of the balloons in any in any balloon anyways like in any balloon type 
So I don't really know who would get that Bloom Liquifier. I personally don't think it's good at all. Uh, or it's just not worth it because either way you're gonna pop them down to nothing or maybe or very close to nothing just with the corrosive glue that you have now or wait what is this called with the uh, balloon dissolver because the balloon dissolver pops two layers every second and uh, yeah and they last the the glue lasts for quite a while so I don't I don't know that's just something that I don't really understand I know some people, uh, some people grab that upgrade, and I don't know why. I don't really find it worth it. But, anyways, that's about it. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you didn't just make sure you hit that like button below. Anyway, that's about it. I will see you guys later.